hello guys today i'm gonna go over a very interesting uh, method like how to find square root without using a calculator that's what i learned in fifth or sixth grade let's see how we can do it so let's say find the square root of 625 we all know i don't know maybe not all 25 let's do it without using a calculator so first of all just write let me use different color 625 it's gonna look like we do division but a little bit different so make a pair from the back so like pair 25 6 just one number so we can't make pair so let's start with a number and we're gonna multiply that number by itself like 1 times 1 gives me 1 2 times 2 gives me 4 3 times 3 gives me 9 and now look at the first number 6 so we're gonna use 2 because 4 is less than 6 as we do in division but here we are dividing it by 2 and 2 times and we're gonna go to 2 whatever number we are using here we're gonna go to that number 2 times 2 is 4 and then subtract 6 minus 4 like as we do in division like in division we bring only one down but over here we're gonna bring the pair these two number like 25 down next step is whatever this number is we're gonna make a double of it so it will be 4 so same thing but we're gonna do 4 let's try 1 we're gonna multiply it by 1 so just simple example 41 so if we are doing 2 I'm gonna multiply it by 2 so that number will go over here and same number will go over there okay 2 times 2 is 4 2 times 4 is 8 Let's go to a little bigger number and see if it works. Let's try 5. And we are multiplying here. So 5 times 5 is 25. 2, 5, 4, 20 plus 2 is 22, which gives me 225. And if we see, that's the number we need. So 4, and I'm going to go to 5, and 5 there. 225 bingo so that tells me square root of 625 is 25 that's my answer let me find if I can let's do another example let me find another number let's say a bigger number I'm gonna do square root of 5000 184 what is square root of this number let's do it again so same method what we're going to make it look like a division problem 5 1 8 4 so let's make pairs so for example like this one we got two pairs this one we had only one number left so there was no pair so now same thing i think three will be smaller let's say 7 times 7 49 8 times 8 64 so 64 is bigger than 51 so we're gonna go with 7 so 7 times 7 gives me 49 gonna do subtraction <coughs> 11 minus 9 is 2 and yeah so just two so now we're gonna bring it the pair down 284 and here seven remember plus two and we make a double becomes four seven the double of seven is 14 so we're gonna find a number over here like we did over here five and five and we got 225 let's try in this case four if i use one gives me one four and one 
now if i'm using let's say two i think that will give me the answer two by two is four two by four is eight two by one is two so 284 that's what we need so two and two 284 so that is my answer the square root of 5184 is 72 let's see i will bring up my calculator and see if we can do it uh, there you go so 5182 51 sorry 5184 and we are doing square root oh, what did i do my bad okay so 51 84 square root there you go 72 72 so without using a calculator you can find square root of any number if you like just leave a comment review or like or subscribe the page to watch more interesting facts and problems in math and physics thank you have a good day guys bye bye